I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Listen, check it out. I got a secret to tell y'all. So y'all saw what it is, what is going on. To be honest with you, yes. That behind you is the Trump Tower that I just walked out of. This is the Chicago River. What if I just threw my phone? <laughs> Hell no, G. These are called, um, uh, what is this called? Um, hold on, it's called, uh, uh, um, hold on, hold on, hold on, I'm finna ask. What's it called when you be like, oh, I jump right now? It's called like intrusive thoughts. Intrusive thoughts, y'all. Intrusive thoughts. I jump right now. I'm just playing. I be having intrusive thoughts on this bridge because I know that that's dangerous, right? But then a part of me is like, ah, oh, jump. Because it's not really to me about killing yourself. It's about how would I survive? Like it's a challenge to me almost because I'm an excellent swimmer. I'm a mermaid, right? And I know I survive, right? Then I'm like, it's gonna be cold. And it's only 40 degrees out here. Look, then nobody got no hat on. Nobody got no gloves on. This is hot to us. It's not cold to us. This is for, we can do this. We survive in this. This is what we're used to. Anywho, I'm in school for acupuncture, Chinese medicine. It's the same school that I went to for massage therapy. Oh, like I was saying, y'all, I do park in the Trump Tower, but first off, before y'all, before, because I know how y'all like to tussle, before y'all go off, what y'all be saying? Not too much. Not too much on me. Trump, first of all, don't even own that building. He just paid to have his name on that, so y'all think he owned the building. Oh, hell no, I'm going to step this up so up, G. Watch out. Watch your step on the Chicago streets. He don't even own that building. He just paid to have his name on it because why? It made people think that you have wealth. And it's not saying he don't have wealth, but it's like, there's, it's just the, the visual image. Like, look at this building. It's huge. You see that, you instantly like, oh, he rich, oh. You know what I'm saying? It's marketing this, you feel me? But yeah, my school, they give us um, like a comp discount on parking because we downtown at the Trump Tower. So instead of me paying like, 30 40 dollars to park down here for, for a few hours or whatever i could pay 14 dollars and park in a trump all day yes i'm parking in trump tower what did you did you plan okay um y'all get a moment boy la ah yes uh rosemary rosemary's baby seat oh jeez chipsy salsa igual Ah, uh, y nada más para. ¿Cómo qué? Para nada. Para nada. ¿Qué es ahorita? Ahorita. Okay, I like ahorita. Okay. Okay, y'all. Yeah, so, yo entiendo mucho español, but I don't speak it that well because I don't speak it often. Obviously, I'm a native English speaker. So, and I do have friends that speak Spanish, um, that Spanish was damn near their first language, but they don't ever speak Spanish to me. So, not all the time, enough, enough for me to like really like have a conversation with them. So whenever I get Mexican food, which is every day, I make sure that I speak Spanish. And since I'm in a restaurant where I'm not just ordering my food to go, I'm actually interacting, I'm making like, like, I just push myself to make myself talk the whole time. That's the only way you're gonna learn. You gotta throw yourself in there. Sometimes when I don't know a word, I'll like ask, like, how do you say it? Which, como se dice? Um, or if like they say something, cause like oftentimes when you like understand a language, even if you don't recognize a certain word, you know like from the rest of the words what the sentence means. So that's why I'll be saying like, I understand a lot, but I don't know how to speak it. Certain stuff I knew like most of the sentence, but it, it'd be certain words that I don't know. I'm like, guess, like I knew what she's saying in English, but I don't know like what that word is. So then that's how I get new words introduced. It's actually cute in here. And it's cute, y'all. Yeah. So I'm waiting on this to get here. But it's vibing in here. Rogan English Taco, y'all. They just mix. I like this little song. They mix it from old school vibes. I like it in here. Got a little guac. Salsa, chips, and salsa. So y'all know, y'all, y'all know the vibe. Look who's here, everybody. It's me. It's me. It's me again. Back at it again. I got number 11. And we got drinks. Oh, yes, we do. Cheers. Which one did you get? I got the same
This is rosemary mezcal. Oh, I don't like mezcal. Mm. I got the I got the strawberry. I like it. And we begin. We have a buddy, 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 buddy day. I love how you change it. My girl said the buddy day. You like that? Yeah, I like that better. Buddy day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is gonna be our new thing. We have a buddy day. Uh, Al pastor, de pollo. Everyone must speak Ablas Espanol. <laughs> did you enjoy your food, madam? I surely did. <laughs> yeah, I love Espanol. Plates clear. He tried to take my taco when I wasn't done with it. It was I was I was still taking my time. He tried to take uh, our numbers too. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yes. We love it, we love it. And we love our waitress. Yes, the best waitress. I'm Mesera. Mesera.